वन टू माई यूट्यूब चैनल टैन थिंग विद डेटा क्योंकि डेटा ही दाता है सो वट आई फॉर यू टूडे वी आर गोइंग टू टॉक अबाउट न्यू डेटा मॉडलिंग इन टैब लॉ बट बिफोर वी मूव फर्दर डू सब्सक्राइब टू माई चैनल इफ यू हैव नॉट येट एंड डू हिट द लाइक बटन इफ यू लाइक दिस कॉन्सेप्ट एंड इफ यू वॉन्ट सम इम्प्रूवमेंट ऑफ यू वॉन्ट मी टू वर्क ऑन एनी टॉपिक्स कमेंट ओवर देयर ओके सो न्यू डेटा मॉडलिंग इन टैब लॉ so let's get started so as you can see over there let me go back to my you know one of the first videos to hit 10k views and you know about that when to blend and when to join so this is the second edition so with this new edition with this new feature of tableau new data modeling it will sort the issues that we had with join so that was my previous video that was made a couple of years back i guess so and at that point of time we were talking about hey we can't do this thing with the uh, join so we can make use of blending or what are the workarounds with join we'll have to make use of lod function so what was that actually so i would really request you to go through that previous video if you are not already aware of and if you are already aware you are set to go but i can still revise the same so you can see with the recent tableau 2 2020.2 release tableau has introduced some new data modeling capabilities with relationship relationships are an easy flexible way to combine data from multiple tables for analysis so here we are talking about relationship we are not so so these are like containers these are like containers having tables having physical tables in on having physical table inside so this looks like the previous version so here we have defined relationship between and you can come out of this like this so we have defined relationship between two data sources this is not join so what we are doing over there now if you see over there you are defining relationship we are defining relationship that okay this table is defining with this this, this data source is defining is uh, related to that data source but tableau brings in the right data for you from the right tables at the right aggregation handling level of detail for you so tableau will do that for you so now i will take you to the previous problem that we had my previous video we have two different tables i'll just summarize and if you want to get into details click on this it is an hyperlink and it will take you to that very particular blog so let me go to that blog blog itself because that is more clear here you can see so you have two data sources and i am when i am doing cross db join if you, you can see i am have to join on state so for uttarakhand expected tourist count is 1000 but when i join these two data sources one is having tourist count another is having expected tourist count with different granularities so for this very particular view when i just want tourist count and expected tourist count with the state since it is having two cities this very particular data source if you see it is doubling the expected tourist count for uttarakhand because you have two cities so because of the that difference in granularities it is doubling it is multiplying so so the aggregation is happening after the join that was the problem again i say if you want to get into detail come here and just see this video read, read this blog but i'm just summarizing it so that's why i was recommending you okay we will go with blending because blending means it's pre aggregated 1000 it's not going to aggregate after joining with the other table or blending with the other table in order to counter it we were using lod functions or doing min max because min of two different 2000 and 1000 will be 1000 only or max will be 1000 only if you have two different 1000 1000 so we were doing that but now what we are saying with the new relationship we don't have to do anything we have to say bye bye to lod functions or whatever manual calculation that we are doing to get the correct level of aggregation so now let's see so what i have done is nothing i'll open it so we have sheet 1 that is the data source number 1 this one so th these are like containers sheet 2 is nothing but the data source 2 this one now tableau will internally 
unlike the previous issues that we had, it will internally take care of the level of aggregation. That means it will not duplicate. Let me see. So I am not expecting that output as per my previous blog, this one. It should be 1000 with the join also, not join but the new relationship. So let us try to do the same thing, state, state. Yes, state expected. First, we'll say tourist count. Say discrete. Okay, but the problem was with the expected tourist count, which was, which was coming 2000 for Uttarakhand. Let us see. Here you go, only 1000. So, here you can see now we have defined the relationship, and Tableau will internally define the aggregation level for you. So, you don't have to do anything. So this is one example and it is quite related to my previous videos uh, videos because I have two videos so I'll uh, uh, try to make and show that you have both you have this blog actually at my YouTube description and you can just go and see so see you ta -da, bye bye and uh, comment share and uh, contacting me data data